Very good morning to you people out there on the interwebs. How are you today? Um, I am a little bit tired. I was up quite late last night getting flipping just stuff done. Um, and I've woken up to the realisation that I'm flying to Africa tomorrow. So, I really need to get everything done today <laughs> that I need to get done. Um, I've quickly just banged out my edit for my vlog. So that's exporting. Um, and I've arranged to meet Steve for lunch in the Juro Cafe in Isha um, just to say my final goodbyes to him although I think he's going to come and visit me in Cape Town so yeah I've got loads to get organised though and the day is moving swiftly is that a thing that people say? I'm running out of time right I'm going to go and meet Steve for some lunch now and go and get this package that from the uh, post office car's gonna start. Yeah. Do you ever get in a car and just think, cars are weird, man? I mean, we roll around in these things. They're weird. <laughs> Sometimes I just think, what a strange concept to be rolling around in a bit of metal. Um, maybe I've just, I've got a bit of a lack of sleep at the moment, so I'm thinking a bit out the box. Uh, nobody's gonna leave me any space to get through, are you? No, because you haven't really thought it through. Thanks for your help. But yeah, so, um, but yes, here we are again, the Juro Cafe. Oh, there's big meetings going down, hello. Right, Steve, what have we got here? Some kind of chicken? Um, chicken roasted vegetables and hummus, and it awesome. looks great. It does look great, doesn't it? Oh, let's tuck in. Which one's yours? I'm at either or, mate. I'll have this guy here. All right, I'll have this one here. You still recording? Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, they got a nice new little um, lunch menu going on in there. It's so good, man. So good. Right, you got work to do, Steve. Yeah, man. Got to crack on. Yeah, me too. Go stop procrastinating in cafes and go and do something useful. <laughs> Maybe see you in a bit. Yeah, awesome man. Cheers, dude. Bro. Yeah. Till <laughs> <See you later. laughs> Love you, bye. See you, bro, bye. Let's go get some work done. Right, I've just booked myself a, um, a quick haircut, so I'm going to pop into Walton now and get that done. Um, late upload tonight, guys. I exported my vlog and it didn't work on the old upload, so I'm going to have to do that again. Sorry about that. Um, also, what else was I going to say to you guys? Can't remember. <sighs> okay, here's um, here's a little thing. This is called a dome port, and it goes on the front of my waterproof housing for my camera. It's how I take my underwater photos and film and stuff. As you can see, it's pretty scratched. I don't know if you can see that. It's all scratched on the inside because something got inside it on the way home from Cape Town um, last earlier this year. This is Perspex plastic, right? Um, what's the best way to get rid of these scratches? Because I've ordered like rubbing compounds so that you can rub it down with different gradients so that you can hopefully polish them out. But um, if any of you guys know somewhere where I can get this done, preferably in Cape Town, or know a good technique to polish perspex or even any advice then just let me know in the comments because um, they don't make these anymore so I really need to fix it
Okay, we are we are starting a new trend here in men's fashion, in men, men's hair design. I've got the old uh, hair clip. Um, what do you think? It's the new look. It's the new look, definitely. definitely. What do you guys think? We might even put another one in. Yeah, let's put two in. Why not? Go wild. Okay, that, that's too much. It's too much. It's taking it too far. Too far. Right, haircut is done. It's a little bit fluffy and bouncy right now, but I need to get some stuff in it. Yeah, loads, loads of people always ask me, and um, what do I ask for when I'm getting my hair done? Well, I just kind of ask for short on the sides and the back, and long on the top. So, and then this is what I end up getting. Doing? Stuff. Dancing stuff. Yeah. Learning. Myself. Oh, I see. And um, one modern. Sam has been amazing and super busy. Look what she's been making. Stickers for everybody. Yeah, man. And um, this one's not quite finished. Though. Yeah, that needs work. No, that didn't go planned, did it? No. no. And then we did that. <laughs> That's fine. I got a little bit angry. That's fine. I'll just take it out of your paycheck. <laughs> so yeah, those need to go in with these in a bit. Um, I've got, I can't even comprehend what I've got to do now, I just want to get to Cape Town. Right, it's Wagamama's o'clock, is what I say. Let's do this, I'm flipping hungry. We are waiting for a stinky Samantha shaped brownie. Oh, here she is. What have you just done? <laughs> what was that? I don't know. Why do you want to find out? <laughs> what do you do with your feet? Do it forwards. <laughs> Why are you doing it like that? <laughs> oh yeah, Wagamamas. What? Wagamamas. <laughs> You need to stop that, You're gonna, oh, your legs are going to come off. Okay, Sam's playing Fruit Ninja. She's smashing it. We've got some edamame on the go. And some chilli squid this time. I thought, why not? You know? um, and some juice, some delicious root, root juice. It's got like carrots and beetroot and something like that in. Perfect, thank you. Oh yeah, I've, I've not only gone for the chicken katsu, I've gone for extra chicken. How awesome is this? Um, so I thought I'd ordered extra chicken, which was here, and then the extra chicken turned up and the extra curry sauce. So this is my meal. <laughs> That's a lot of food. I'm gonna I'm gonna roll out here like a little fatty. You might be able to take the other bag. I'm not taking any doggy bags, man. Yeah. That's not how I roll. Wagamama's walrus, please. <laughs> oh, it's your turn. No. Yeah. <laughs> Wagamama's walrus. Watch out for splinters. It's not a very attractive look, Pam. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Miss. <laughs> <laughs> and we are s s really full. I am full of katsus, curries, and chickens, and rices. Cheers, bye. Sounds going to bed, and I'm not going to see her. Aww. Yeah, I'm not going to see her coming. Oh bless little in your little animal onesie thing. <laughs> I'll see you in a few months. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely come out and visit. Shame man. <laughs> you got your dressing gown <laughs> on as well. I'm missing something here. Yeah? No, no, no. Oh, see you in the morning. No, I'll see you in the morning. See you when you get in. I am currently making swallow stickers and listening to Chemical Brothers. Um, because everybody that's pre-ordered a sweatshirt is getting one of these swallow stickers uh, free with their order, so I've got to make a lot.
Well, it is 1.30 in the morning and I've just been working solidly on getting those jumpers and t-shirts packaged up. There are so many, I cannot believe how many people are ordering stuff. Um, and it's all going to go out before I actually leave for Cape Town, which is really cool. I am shattered, absolutely shattered. Um, but in a good way, like an accomplished, getting stuff done, chatted. It's really nice to see Steve for the last time today. Um, might see him tomorrow, but you never know. And I already miss Louis. I already miss Jack and Finn. I miss Will. I miss everybody already, and I haven't even left yet. Um, but hopefully some of them will come and visit me in Cape Town. Um, but yeah, remember guys, to work hard. Be nice to people and try not to get lost or killed. Okay, love you, bye. Morning, people, how's it going? What are you up to? Give me some news, give me some good news. Um, we are feeling pretty lazy this morning, although Jack forked me out of bed this morning. I did, 9 a.m. actually, can't waste the moment. <laughs> I was enjoying that sleep. Um, we're just gonna go get some breakfast, you know how it is. Because ain't no rest for the wicked. Amen to that. Money don't grow on trees. I don't know, I can't remember the next bit. 